answers with some questions and some hard things with some things. And this is my review of Kings Island for Halloween Haunt 2021. Now, please note this. My thoughts and opinions on this event is going to vary from somebody else. So take this with a pinch of salt. It's a fun event, but I feel like it's one of those events that gets way too crowded. Um, that I went this past Saturday, um, which was October the 9th, and um, it was just way too crazy, it was way too busy. Um, you couldn't really get much stuff done, but it is a fun event. Now, on Saturdays, it's from 6 to midnight. Uh, on sat Saturdays, it's from 7 to midnight. Now, I'm not entirely sure why you add an extra hour in there, but um, anyway. It starts off uh, on the stage of near the near the Eiffel Tower, where they have the opening ceremonies, and it it's just basically a lot of the stuff like, you know, to get the monsters pumped up and stuff like that, go to the houses and stuff. Now from there, there'll be like fireworks or something that will go off, and you'll start to see monsters roam around and then some go to their houses and stuff and from there music wise throughout the park they will play like halloween type music or in the front for some odd reason they play like death metal style music but it is fun but you are going to see a lot of teenagers at the event. Now, while that's fine, they can get a little crazy. But, like, the, the thing you are going to notice the most is not as many actors as previous years because of the current staffing situation but I mean overall it is a fun event to go to I highly suggest you try it if you decide to go um, 